Here post game with head coach Kyle Reckless following Milwaukee's awesome, thrilling, amazing 72-60 win over Green Bay. Coach, wins over Green Bay in this league are hard to come by, uh, but you guys just seem to have an answer at every point in this game. I was really proud of our team. You know, when you go on the road and you lose a game by 42 points, uh, you just don't know how your team is going to respond the next opportunity you have to play them. Uh, I really loved our mentality in practice this week. Uh, we came in with a lot of confidence, uh, the fact that we were playing at home and we know we can shoot a little bit better here. But we came in with a almost like a ruthless mentality that we were going to score in the paint and that we weren't going to just make it a three-point shootout. Uh, I just, I'm really proud of our team. You know, our upperclassmen really stepped up. Uh, and our even our bench, who didn't get in the games, they were just really encouraged the whole way through. Uh, all five starters in double figures uh, shot a season high 58% from the floor, but probably more importantly, holding Green Bay to just 35% shooting on their end. Well, this is the best defensive game we've played all season. Uh, it's something that we've really been struggling at is, uh, is the defensive side. And we put in a new defense this week, and our team just really bought into it. And that was the biggest part about it. We said, you're going to make a lot of mistakes while doing it because it's new. Uh, but just continue to communicate, continue to play with the energy that we need to be successful and the toughness, uh, and find a way to win it. Uh, and our team did that. You know, and I, I thought Alexis and Sierra at the top really dictated a lot about what we did. But the back line worked equally as hard to make sure that we got those rebounds. Absolutely. It seemed like, as you talked about, the play in the post uh, was very successful, especially because of passes from players like Sierra and Alexis finding open players for seemingly wide open layups. That was the best our post game has been. We've been challenging our posts all season to demand the ball and continue to hold their seals and post ups. They fought every single minute that they were on the court. Uh, Jordan did it, Lizzie did it when they got in, um, our starting post did it. It, it was incredible to watch their mentality of wanting the basketball and our guards just giving it to them. I mean, there was times they had two, three people on them and Steph found kick out passes. That's why she had five assists. You know, I think Jenny had four assists. I mean, they just, they found open people off of the double teams um, or when they weren't doubled they found ways to finish and for us to beat you know Green Bay who's a very dominating team in the paint in the paint for that game was really big for us. Uh, finally Steph Kostowitz scores her 1000th career point just what does that mean now two players having done that this season both juniors? Well, you know, Steph has been a force to reckon with. And you have to remember, she took off most of her freshman season. She was back and forth because she just had, she had so many injuries with shin splints. And, you know, Steph has battled through so much um, on the physical side. And it's nice to see her get that reward. She had fun playing tonight. I could see it written all over her face uh, when she made that basket right at the beginning and got the and one. Um, the mentality, like, you could just see that switch in her mind. She was communicative in any huddle that we had. She was, like, commanding the huddles. Uh, she was a fun player to coach tonight. Um, and she's been a fun player to coach the last, you know, two and a half years. I'm looking forward to the fact that we still have one more year with her. Absolutely. Well, congratulations on the win. Have a good night. Thank you. We definitely wanted to be tougher. We wanted to really focus on our defense, and I think that showed today. And I think we just wanted it really bad. And then also uh, in the game, your thousandth career point, uh, coming at the free throw line, becoming the 25th player in program history to score 1,000 points for your career. What does that mean to um, both – achieve that milestone and do it in this game. It was a fun game to do it in. I'm glad it was this fun. But I'm very lucky to have the teammates around me that I do that they're so good that I'm that open at times and they're able to get me the ball. So I commend them. Gotcha. Well, thank you very much and congrats on the win. Thank you.